Hello, fellow Toastmasters and most welcome guests, and especially Chris. Um, thank you for coming to our club tonight and giving your speech. It was super amazing. Um, I was totally caught off guard um, when you first started your speech. It was, it, I didn't expect the, the, all the theater, which was really great and it brought me in right away. Um, Chris's speech is, was titled Ode to Competition. And um, I wanna go over some suggestions that I would, uh, that I found to help him, to help you with your next speech um, at a speech competition and, um, and some of your strengths. So I, what I really loved about your speech was you're a great storyteller. The story of how you um, went to competitions, how you got involved in them, how you've had some different ups and downs throughout the whole journey. Um, but at the end, it was very inspiring because you, you kind of showed us even if you don't make it, um, try again and you can succeed. There was a lot of evidence and facts presented that uh, really helped me as a, a Toastmaster member want to give uh, a speech at a competition. Uh, even with my own struggles, uh, you explained your own struggles so I could relate to that. Um, some of um, your strong points, I would say where you have great hand gestures, uh, lots of, uh, every time you gave certain points, your hands, you used your hands to explain a lot of different things. You came in and out of the camera with your hands. That was really great. And your body coming back and forth, uh, just really uh, engaging. You also uh, went and asked the audience questions to engage us and that was really incredible I thought because we all were excited and raised our hands and uh, it was really fun and your eye contact was I felt like when you given your speech you were looking right at me and I really enjoyed that so I really had that personal touch um, there were only a few things that I could suggest since it was such an awesome speech <laughs> Um, I was thinking maybe adding um, some nodding with uh, when you're giving certain points. So when you nod your head like yes or no, uh, along with the balance of your hands, could uh, improve uh, a person and persuade them, improve the way they feel about giving a speech. It'd be uh, nodding heads is like a unconscious uh, kind of way of persuading people. Uh, also maybe smiling and frowning in certain parts. Um, and what else did I, oh, at the beginning of the speech, it was really, really great. But I was thinking that maybe um, adding, slowing down a little bit because it was so theatrical in the very beginning, I felt like I, lost what you were saying because I was wrapped up in your theatrics, but it was really great. I look, uh, well, you're a guest, so I hope and wish you the best of luck in your next speeches, and I hope I was able to inspire you a little bit. Thank you so much for sharing your speech with our club tonight. It was awesome. Thank you.